Yo! What's poppin' YouTube? So let's jump right into this unlimited reputation glitch for the brand new Los Santos Car Meet location, all right? So we all know with the brand new update, we got the reputation. Brand new reputation, so a new way to level up in the game. You get certain cosmetics, items, things like that, and you unlock them as you level up. Okay, well, if you don't know by now, it's very, very hard to level up. All right, so with this video, you are going to be able to get to at least a level 180, 200 very, very quickly within 30 minutes, literally 45 minutes, not even. Okay, so let's go ahead and get right into it. The first thing you are going to need is a MOC. All right, so open up your phone, go to the internet. Go to Warstock Cash and Carry. The MOC will be right here at the top, okay? Or, I'm sorry, not at the... Yeah, it is at the top. Right here at the top, all right? If you do not have in Bay 3 already, you will need to go to Bay 3, and you will need the personal vehicle storage, all right? Once you have your MOC with the personal vehicle storage, you're going to want to come to this location right here on the map. You can do this in an invite-only session, friend session, public lobby, however you want to do it. I'm in my own session, like I said, however you want to do it. All right, so come to the LS Car Meet location. You're going to want to get your MOC with that personal vehicle storage in the back, and you're going to want to park it just like I did, all right? You're going to want to have these two circles pretty darn close to each other, all right? As close as you can get them. So once you have your MOC parked like that, and you're as close as you can get those two blue circles together, you're going to pull the car out of the MOC that you have parked in the back, all right? So from here, we're going to go ahead and pull it out. Give it a few seconds to load. I'm going to show you exactly what to do from here. All right, so once we pulled it out, I mean, it's very self-explanatory from here. I'm pretty sure y'all know what we're going to do. We're going to pretty much pull it right into the two of these blue circles, all right? But from here, first, what we need to do is pull up our phone so we do not actually go straight into the LS car meet. So pull up your phone. Keep your phone open. You're going to want to park it, like, right in between the two blue circles right here, whichever you think is best. Close your phone and start spamming right on the D-pad. All right, just like that spamming right on the d-pad now if it does work for you you should hear the garage door in the background as you can tell right there it did not work for me that's completely fine with this glitch it's super super easy to rinse and repeat you won't need to set it set it all up or do anything like that very very simple so once again we're going to pull the vehicle out of the moc pull up our phone and we're going to go ahead and drive right in between these two blue circles okay see if we can park it a little bit closer to this garage door and run somebody over while we're at it Spam right on the D-pad. Keep spamming. See if we got it this time. Nope, did not get it that time. That's all right. Like I said, it's very, very simple to do. If you don't hit it, just get back in the vehicle and pull it out. I might need to pull my MOC a little bit closer. I think that's what's going on. But let me go ahead and try one more time just to see if I get it. All right, so keep that phone up. I'm going to park the vehicle right in between the two blue circles and start spamming right on the D-pad. All right, just like that. Like I said, you should hear the garage in the background if this is working, okay? So right there, the loading screen is taking a little bit longer. I did hear the garage in the background. Now, do not worry, your car will, it's gonna disappear, but I promise you do not lose your vehicle. Uh, but yeah, from there you hit the glitch. Um, if you spawn in like that, you hear the garage, the cars are disappearing, the people are disappearing. You have hit the glitch. There should be no people in the LS car meet, all right? There should just be vehicles if you have hit the glitch. So from here, what you wanna do is come up to this clothing rack right here, all right? It is in the LS car meet once you get here. Now there is a way to do this unlimited. What I want you to, so I'm sure if you're not familiar with this, you are all you're gonna have to do to level up your character right now is buy clothes. So usually, when you come to this clothing rack, it is it doesn't give you all these options. It gives you just a few options. What recently just came out with the with the update, okay? Well, with this, it glitches out the game, and now you're able to access all the tops that you can access inside of a regular clothing store. All right. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna buy all the cheapest items. All right. So we're gonna go to. I think I've already done this because I'm already level 95. As you can tell, I've already bought a bunch of things. But every time you buy, as you can tell, look at my level, it shoots right up. You just purchase everything in the game, and it shoots right up. I mean, we I'm a, I'm a high level right now. I'm level 91, and I'm already, I already just hit 92. And right when I said I hit 92, I'm already at 93. I mean, you level up so fast with this. Yes, you will need to spend some money, but let me show you. There is a way to do this unlimited, because I'm sure some of you are thinking, like, all right, dude, there's a 1,000 levels. We're going to run out of clothes here. We don't have enough money for all this. Well, if you go down to, let me see, work jackets, and you purchase this first work jacket right here, and you go down to 
add crew emblem all right so go to crew emblem and you just purchase the crew emblem remove the crew emblem purchase the crew emblem remove the crew emblem look at my level that's all you got to do 9,500 every time because some of the clothes are really expensive they cost you know twenty thousand thirty thousand dollars instead of spending that every time you can even purchase free clothes if you haven't bought any of the free clothes go get those go get all the cheapest tank tops all the cheapest t-shirts and then after you purchase all the cheapest clothes in the game that are less than 9,500 just go to the worker jackets purchase the first one and go to the crew emblems and from there you will be able to level up super fast I mean as you get to at the beginning of the video I was level 91 and as you level up it will be harder to level up so you'll have to get more and more RP per level all right so as you can tell, I'm already at 95, and we've only been doing this for a few minutes. Um, I think it's something crazy, like 100, 100 million or 30 million. I'm not sure what it is. I know it's a ridiculous amount of money to get to level a rep 1,000, but there is no absolute reason why you need to get that rep level. Um, I think the highest rep level you need to be is like 220 for something, or I think. I'm, I'm not even totally sure. But I know it's not over 500. There is no reason that you need to spend that much money. I think you should be good around level 1, 100, 120. That's pretty much when you unlock all the liveries, all the rims for the vehicles is around level 100 or 120. So once you get to level 100 or 120, I would just go ahead and stop from there and go ahead and level up legitly the rest of the way. I mean, obviously do this glitch as much as possible right now because they will patch this very, very soon, I promise. But as you can tell, like I've just been sitting here talking to y'all, explaining a few things, and I'm already at level 97. I mean, you could literally sit your little brother or sister on this game, pay them five or ten bucks for the day, and just tell them to do this for you. And you will be rank 1000, I promise. Like I said, you're going to need some money to spend, but you know, if you have a few cards you don't want, just go sell those few cards so you can uh, level yourself up. All right, so I mean that's pretty much it. Everything's gonna save. What I would do just to make sure it does save is actually leave the LS car meet and like kill yourself or something like that. So I'm gonna go ahead and do so as re as soon as I reach level 100. Let's see if I can speed this up a little bit. You can get it to go a little bit faster. It's just a little glitchy right now. Um, let's go ahead and get to level 100 here. Very very simple glitch though. Um, I mean I don't know how they didn't think of this. When the, you know when the update came out all right level 100 so from here we're just going to go ahead and back out and we're going to go to the exit all right and from there it should save i'm just going to go ahead and kill myself that's what i like to do to make sure it saves um but yeah that's that's pretty much it for this video i hope it helped you out um comment down below if it did and i'll catch y'all soon in the next one boys peace Morgan Chest is a fun...